everyone. I'd like to welcome you to BeMoreNews.com, the news before the news where we uncover the truth. We're here with the new media icons, if you will, or re-emerged, huh? Let's start over here with, with the man of E-Media himself, Mr. Eric Stewart. How are you, sir? I'm doing just fine, Donnie. Good. We're down here at the African American Heritage Festival. What can we expect from E-Morgan Solutions, E-Media? Well, first of all, I just want to say, isn't this beautiful? I just want you to just show everyone uh, that, that views your site, that follows you, how beautiful a job LeBron Finney did. Have to give uh, hats off to him and the entire committee, uh, right from the mayor's office down. It's just a wonderful event. It's a national and international spectacle. And I think that everyone around the country just needs to take notice of what Mr. Finney has put together. And it's just a beautiful event. But the Morgan Solutions is providing resources to the community for financial empowerment. And that's what we're doing. Okay, tell us about the Mark Clark Show so we can interview this guy to your left. Okay. Mr. Mark Clark, of course, uh, has been displaced in this town by radio, by force. But I think it was God's way of pushing Mark on to bigger and better things. And I can show you better than I can tell you. Just stay tuned to My 24 every morning, 7 to 8 a.m., and you'll see what I'm talking about. Mark Clark, what can we expect doing your show? I mean, you're doing a dynamic job. And congratulations to both of you on just the camaraderie, the, the coming together, the cooperation. Thank you, Donnie. Thank you so much. And what you said, Donnie, is so, is so, is so right. You know, the, the, the real deal is Eric Stewart believed in me, and more than believing in me, he put his money on me. And Donnie, you know, it's um, it's a blessing. You know, I think, like I said, when I, you know, when I watch the show, it's not exactly where I want it to be. I have a feeling it probably never will be. But what I'm proud of is the fact is that, again, Eric and I have teamed together. We, you know, it's ours. Uh, we're set to make millions. But the main thing we're set to change lives and actually make a difference in the community, which you know, Don, is what I've always been about. This allows me to tell the story that, don't, that you don't see on the news. And actually, I guess in some cases, we're, we're in a battle heads up. But in our show, we can do a 10-minute segment on Donnie Glover, who's doing positive things. We can do a 10-minute segment on Miss Ernie, who's 73, who still is, you know, running 10 to 12 miles a day or watching Ray Lewis train. So it really has just been an extension of what we did on the Big Fat Morning Show. But the main story is Eric and I as partners are, are, are you know, we have a platform that makes that can make Baltimore shine. So that's, that's a big story. I heard a preacher recently say that you know you have the Holy Spirit if you help empower others. And Mark Clark is the beginning, I understand. Not the beginning, just another uh, chapter in my book. But I mean, as the TV thing goes, you're, you're looking to expand. Oh, yes, yes. yes. Uh, the secret's out. I shared it with you, but since you made it public, <laughs> there it is. Um, yes, Mark is just uh, the first of many. My goals are not small. They are to commit a major position in media on the local, regional, and national, and then global front. I like to change the entire perception of uh, the way the community looks at media. See, I was just going to hit you right with that BET, big ass chain, <laughs> brown T Pain's neck, and just the imagery of us African Americans that's out there, man. That's not who we are. Well, you know, uh, we are a diverse culture, diverse community. I don't want to take too much away from a BET. I will. But, but what I would like to do is I'd like to see more empowerment so we can see more diversity. There is uh, uh, a, a community that does want to see the things that they see on BET, but that shouldn't be saturated into our community. The violence and the news that's reporting so, such negative images of our community should not be there. But by far, my, my, my pursuit of media is not just for the African American community, but for our communities as a whole to be able to come together and really respect each other. And I think that news and media as, as a whole has disrespected the black community. So first and foremost, I, I must raise my race um, and show them only in a positive light, and I will not entertain um, 
the other side because I feel like that's already saturated. So I do want to bring some variety, but I do want to be careful that I represent our community in positive light. Your, your word, your take on this. Yeah, well, Donnie, I think, first of all, we've got to have you on the show to talk about, I read your blog on the BET Awards, and actually Troy Johnson commented on the show, by the way, Troy Johnson, also part of the show, off the mic, he's on the show now. But, uh, you know, like Eric said, I think you're right, you know, from a, from a media point of view, there's certain aspects of our community that are always shown, they've oversaturated, you know, we, there, there's room for uh, much more diversity, there's room for positivity, and there's room for the special stories that are out there. So, you know, I'm not as heated about the BET thing as you are, Donnie. I understand, you know, kind of some of the dynamics. And actually having a TV show, you kind of get it too, you know. Michael Jackson passes away. We, were they going to get clearance for all those Michael Jackson video and all the footage that they needed? No. Uh, so I'm learning too, man. You know, I'm learning how the TV game works. But all those things we'll be talking about. And Donnie, you're going to be leading the way on the Mark Clark Show soon. Good deal. How can people get in touch with you, Mr. E Media, Mr. Eric Stewart? Well, it's easy to find me. Of course, you need to watch the Mark Clark TV show every morning on my 24. 7 to 8 a.m. Monday through Friday. Also, you can go to markclarktv.com, but the way to get me directly is emediamd.com, or you can give us a call at 410-486-0716. We got the mayor there. Hi, hey, mayor, the mayor. What can I get my... The mayor's going to go. I'm going to stand with the mayor. I can. What are you I do it all the time. Uh, Monday? This Monday what time? Okay, I'll be there. I'll be there. Okay, six o'clock with the mayor. All right. You heard it. I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna be there. <laughs> That's good stuff. Thank you very much, gentlemen, for your time. Keep watching BeMoreNews.com, the news before the news where we uncover the truth. <laughs>